Hey, what's going on, everybody? Matthew from the RightTrader.com back again with another cryptocurrency video. And today we're going to be talking about XRP and the Ripple lawsuit and a price prediction for XRP in 2023. We're going to be diving into the details of the chart and seeing where we might be heading this year. Now, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. And I also already made a price prediction video in 2023 for Bitcoin and ETH if you want to check that out on my channel. Now, with that being said, let's get right into it. XRP here is at the sixth spot with a market cap of $20 billion. Of course, XRP has always been one of the biggest crypto coins. And to be honest, I don't really ever see that changing. With that being said, I like to see XRP in the top 10. If it's in the top five, that's even better, okay? So right now we're at the sixth spot and the price is hanging right around 41 cents, which is actually right on top of a support level but we're right on the support, okay? We're basically in the midway point between our uh, main range that we've been in, okay? Which is between 31 cents and uh, 50 cents at the high. So that's something that we've been in since uh, May of last year. And, you know, by the looks of it here, since we are still quite range bound and we could be heading back into this purple, um, you know, uh, consolidation range that I had drawn in, right? Uh, this could continue for quite some time. So this could be a pretty flat year for XRP. With that being said, I do think there's a chance that we could end up quite a bit higher than where we are now, but I'll explain how that can come about. Now, it's important when talking about XRP to mention the uh, lawsuit, okay? And the Ripple CEO, uh, not long ago here, uh, early January, mentioned something about, you know, the, uh, the lawsuit and uh, his expectations on when it might come to an end. Now, what I want to warn about this and why I'm saying that XRP could have a pretty flat year, which I am expecting a pretty flat year, uh, if not a slight 50 to 100 percent rise on most cryptos. Um, so not huge, you know, multi hundred, multi thousand percent gains here uh, are expected for 2023. But we could see a nice 50 to 100 percent pump. Um, and, you know, but I think we could pull back uh, after that and end the year fairly flat, right? With mainly only a 20 to 50% increase. So uh, why is that important? And why is that even more so important with Ripple? Well, first off, Ripple tends to have extreme, uh, extremely long periods of consolidation. That can be seen with what's been happening right here. And if we head back into um, XRP's history, right? Uh, excuse this extremely meshy chart, but bear with me for a second. You can see in this area right over here, okay? Uh, just how long we've been having a uh, you know very tight consolidation for in the previous uh, crypto winter and right over here in this area okay so uh, we've seen months and years of XRP flat being nearly uh, flat okay XRP's price being nearly flat for months or years that's happened before and that could happen again that's literally been happening for the last few months and it has no real signs of stopping just yet okay i also want to mention that despite xrp still performing quite well it has underperformed in the last month both eth and bitcoin okay they moved up over 30 percent xrp did end up green but it only moved up uh, about 12 percent okay so it underperformed quite a few uh, altcoins out there now xrp is kind of like a uh, ethereum classic in the sense that you know it is a little bit slower to pump but once it pumps it does pump very quickly and quite a bit but it has to have that catalyst for that to happen and the main thing that we're waiting on okay despite the fact that uh xrp tends to move a bit slower and that it tends to have these consolidations the real true thing that's holding it back and that stunted its bull run in the previous bull market is the sec lawsuit now um ripple uh ceo brad garlinghouse uh gave a quote here okay and he said that they uh, he expects a decision from a judge certainly in 2023 you don't really have control this is the key part here over when a judge makes their decisions but i'm optimistic that sometime in the coming single digit months we'll have closure there this is an answer that i don't really like okay uh he's you know giving his own expectation which is sometime in 2023 right making it seem somewhat certain but right after that, he says that there's no telling when it's actually going to end. 
It could be months, it could be years, it could be one to two years, three years, no one really knows when this is going to end, okay? What I can tell you for sure is that the lawsuits always take longer than expected, so don't be surprised if it happens very late in 2023 or not even in 2023 at all, right? Could happen in 2024, could happen in 2025, okay? But I'd expect something more towards the end of 2023, beginning or, or sometime in the year of 2024, to be much more likely than this year in 2023 for many, many reasons out there, okay? Uh, now, of course, he disagrees with the SEC uh, lawsuit that it goes without saying. And um, uh, we also have this quote here. Not once did they say to me, uh, we think XRP may be a security. Uh, you know, still, no matter what you think about, no matter what your opinion is, we need to see what happens with the lawsuit. And, uh, you know, buying up uh, XRP before we get news on that is a very long waiting game for one and also carries strong amounts of risk, right? I do think that eventually we'll get clearance on that and that uh, the XRP price will uh, come flying back up higher, but we don't know when that's going to be. And, uh, you know, how likely is it? It depends, right? I'd still say it's fairly 50-50%. It's probably a little bit more than that. I'd say it's probably a 60 to 70% chance that uh, we get strong positive outcome for a ripple, but it's not guaranteed, right? And uh, the time frame is certainly, certainly not guaranteed. So I do expect more consolidation. With that being said, XRP is still a crypto that anybody can trade around the world. And that means that it tends to move in line with what the rest of the crypto market is doing, right? It did still end up green as Bitcoin and ETH pumped. And if Bitcoin and ETH continue to pump, which is something that I am expecting uh, for the next few months, XRP is probably going to head higher, okay? So we already managed to bounce nicely off our support level, which was at around 31 cents. We moved up 30% from there. And now we're looking to head a little bit higher, okay? Which I think can happen. It may take, you know, about another month to start really clearing up the price for XRP. But as soon as we get above 50 cents, we're going to start to see the price really come back up quite a bit higher in a short amount of time, okay? So once we hit 50 cents, we have a last bit of resistance around 55 cents. And then we should be able to hit the 65 cent level. The ultimate high that I'm expecting for this year would be around 75 cents. I don't expect XRP to go higher than that. So from the current price, that's going to be a 85% uh, move. And from the, the bottom here, uh, that will have been a 150% move. Okay, uh, we could see more modest price gains of only going up to around 65 uh, cents, but that would still be an over 100% gain from the bottom. So don't expect anything too crazy for XRP this year, but we should end up higher than where we are now. We could end up seeing several months though of around the same price range we're in uh, for the time being around this 40 cent level. But I do expect within the next one, two, uh, three months that we should be quite a bit higher uh, above 50 cents uh, after that. With that being said, hopefully you enjoyed this XRP price prediction. I'm never biased with these predictions. Uh, and keep in mind, none of this is financial advice, so you need to do your own due diligence. But thank you so much for watching. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on the bell notifications, and make sure to follow me on Twitter as well for live cryptocurrency market updates. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Let me know your thoughts on what you think is going to happen with XRP and its lawsuit in 2023 and beyond. Let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Have a great day, everyone. Stay safe.